All right, so over my last like 17 or so videos that I have in this playlist all about cruising for free, I've covered how to get free cruises from a bunch of different cruise lines, some of the biggest in the world, like uh, Royal Caribbean, uh, Virgin Voyages, MSC, Carnival, Princess. Uh, but what I noticed is, is that a lot of the how to get free cruises from Royal Caribbean is kind of spread out over a bunch of different videos. So I thought today I'll make a video about the four ways that you can cruise for free on Royal Caribbean. Let's go. Hey, what's up? My name is Chris Fantini and my channel is all about getting you on cruise ships for free. Big brands, the newest ships, uh, great times. You're only paying for port fees and taxes, maybe gratuities, maybe some drinks. Uh, I've got so many videos on how you can stretch your bankroll and earn more points and get better cruises, uh, a ton of great stuff like that. I also have a bunch of videos on cruising for free with Royal Caribbean, but they're kind of spread out uh, along my playlist. So I've got like a bunch of different methods, but they're kind of hard to find unless you're gonna watch all the videos and nobody's got time for that. So what I thought I'd do is I'd make a video of the four ways that you can cruise for free on Royal Caribbean. Additionally, I may have gotten a few things not exactly right in some of my previous videos because I was kind of chronicling my experience as I went along. So some of the stuff that I said was just assumptions and since then I've learned a lot more. So let's start by doing the easiest way to get a free cruise from Royal Caribbean and work our way up from there. All right, so the first way to get a free cruise from Royal Caribbean is exclusively for people who have not cruised on Royal Caribbean since 2018. This is the casino matching offer. So basically, if you have offers from either another cruise line like Princess or Virgin or Carnival or any of those, you can use that offer and leverage it for a free cruise from Royal Caribbean. Additionally, if you've got offers from like MGM or Caesars for land-based casinos, you can also use that. Again though, you cannot have sailed on Royal Caribbean since 2018 to qualify, and also you can't have any active cruises booked with Royal Caribbean. So if you wanna go that way, if you qualify, uh, I will put the link uh, how to get started in the description. So the second way to earn free cruises from Royal Caribbean is once you get on the ship, and that is purely by earning points. The second and third methods kind of work in concert because they both pertain to earning points. So the second method is by getting instant certificates on the ship. So every time you cycle $5 through a slot machine or you spend $10 in some table games, you will earn one tier credit. If you earn 1200 tier credits on a single cruise, you will unlock an instant certificate. It'll give you a list of qualifying cruises that you can book. Then all you do is you go to the next cruise desk and you put a deposit down for the cruise of your choice. Boom, you're in. These uh, go up in value and you get more selection, better ships, longer sailings, better rooms, the more points that you earn. So it starts at 1,200, there's one at 1,500. Uh, I think there might be one at 2,000, but I might be wrong. I do know there is one at 2,500. So that is method number two. Method number three is hitting prime. Once you hit 2,500 tier credits in any year, which I believe is March to March of every year, you will become prime. That will earn you one free cruise, huge selection of sailings, um, and very few blackout dates, some holidays and whatnot. But it is a very good selection and you get free drinks as well. Now, if you manage to hit prime in one single cruise, you will get the $2,500 instant certificate Plus, you'll get your tier award cruise as well. So you'll get two free cruises, which is pretty awesome. And of course, don't forget the free drinks. The fourth way to cruise for free on Royal Caribbean is a little bit more vague and there's a little bit of voodoo involved, but this is the one that I've leveraged the most. I've gone on a ton of free cruises with Royal Caribbean this way, and that is by getting email offers. Getting email offers is based on an algorithm that's not really publicly known, but me and my friends have kind of talked about it a lot and determined how we've gotten the offers. And it seems to be mostly based on Theo. Theo is your theoretical expected losses in the casino. This is based 
mostly on the time spent in the casino. Because, of course, the longer you spend in a casino, the more the casino expects you to lose, right? So they want to try to attract you to come back on the ships if you have a high Theo. We do also believe the money you spend, the tier credits you earn have a hand in it, but we've had some of our friends who have spent a lot of money in the casino and they still don't get email offers. Additionally, we suspect it has something to do with whether you have booked paid cruises already in your queue. If you're paying for a bunch of cruises, they are less likely to offer you email offers because you're already coming on the ship. Coming up for me, I'm doing Grandeur of the Seas and Utopia on Royal Caribbean. I plan on shooting videos on the true cost of free cruising, so everything that I pay for along my way, be it gas, parking, gratuities, all of those things, so you can see how much a free cruise actually costs. And then additionally, I'm gonna do a video on my favorite slot machines in the casino. Some of these machines are great for payback, which lets you uh, stretch your bankroll and also uh, make your Theo look better and some of them are just like machines I like to play So look for those videos to come up soon. Of course, if you want to be notified Make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so you'll know as soon as these videos are posted Thank you so much. I'm finally at a thousand subscribers and I appreciate each and every one of you watching